Leo. Shamrock Tarot General reading rules could be reversed, may not resonate. Message from Sirius. Oh, why the loom gloom, darling? Told you all this was gonna happen. When I call your name, you might as well just come because the longer you wait, then I got time to think about it, what I'm gonna say to you. So I would suggest you coming when I call your name. Ah, you've reached your plateau, your plate, we call it, and you have, that's that generational wealth. You have created what, and generated what you can handle. You agreed to get all your money at the beginning and how you managed your money, that, that was on you, you're an adult. Uh, you're too tired to get another job right now. Eventually, you're going to be picking up another job. So, you need to start thinking about what you want to do. If you're tired, you need to uh, meditate. Breakups are very tiring, especially when you're dealing with somebody who's not on your level and you put them on a pedestal and then you're holding them up there because you wanted to prove a point to everybody. Uh, the house is just way too big for you. You cannot manage it. You don't have any kids and you don't have any grandkids coming in. You need to get rid of the house. There's no point in having a big three bedroom house with a sunroom. Uh, whatever you get out of that, that is between you and your creators. I don't, ha I, I'm not, um, I don't have access to your projects. Most of us just get an interior decorating badge for that so that uh, next time our next life will be on a different level. It has nothing to even do with this. So whatever you are doing with that, that's between you and your creators with your project planning. You did not physically do any of the work. So I don't know if you'll get credit for that, what, you, what you'll get credit for. Time management, I don't know. You didn't do any of the work. You hired contractors, you didn't budget in anything. Um, yeah, there's your eye rolling. <sighs> so I don't, you, you need to sell like as soon as possible. And I was already telling you that like a year ago. So, uh, do, 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 do. I, you need to look at your housing market. I mean, you got a lot on your plate. You're going through a breakup. You need to move, you need, um, a living space that is acquirable for you, you and only you and your animals. So preferably next to water, you need, uh, the number three, three, three came up. You need water. Uh, no offense. This is everybody out there in the Midwest. I don't know how any of you can survive without ever going to the beach or ever going to the lake or to the river or whatever. And it's not you. It's everybody out there. Everybody here where I live, we're like six hours away from the beach. And everybody goes, budgets in and goes on vacation every week to the beach. It's like, or the lake. It's like a normal thing that everybody does. Okay, so if you can't budget that in and take off, then you need to take your work with you. You need to tell your realtor that you only need X amount of space to live in. Okay, you don't need a big basement. You don't need any of that stuff. You need like a condo or like a, a small town home, something. The dog's dying. You can get rid of the dog soon. You know, um, anyways, three, 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 you need water, you need a cleansing. Um, yeah, you need to connect with water. You need to come with your questions. Everybody goes through this orphan phase. We've all been orphaned. We've all been pushed through the, through the church. You plateau on your lessons and your learnings and filling up your cup. You, and I want to say, you know, you're not greedy, but spiritually you are. You fill up your cup. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. And then it, it gets filled up. And when you have the, the it overflowing, you don't want to give it out. You want it to go back in. And that's not how we generate here. You agree to the dark or the light. You agree back to the light again. And here we are. Now your contract with the devil's up. It's time for you to start giving back. You need to speak to your creators about those questions about your money and 
your planning and you got exactly how much you can generate with the flow of people coming into you. So whoever left, that's not up to you or the mass public, your creators do that, yourself, your higher self, and you got the amount that you can handle, okay? So you need to sit and think, who am I? Why do I do this? What am I getting out of this? You know, you already got your people getting whatever they are getting out of it. So, and you can't handle anymore. They've already tested you on all that stuff. There's no budget planning. You never look into the future. You're always just in the here and now, which is fine. But, you know, eventually you're going to have to buy a new couch or a new bed or, you know, you got to eat. That's another thing is your nutrition. Oh, we're going to gain weight. You got to deal with that. Healthy women have weight on them. Divine women, women of God, you have weight and meat on you and muscles and thick bones. You're not a peasant. Divine density. Path of the divine warrior. Look at that. They want to put you in the warrior road. Temple of black oxidine. So you need some of that. Dark healing chamber. You probably need all new stones. Don't worry about that right now, but. High Priestess. You are leveling up, but just in a different level, a different energetic level. The Eyes of Isis. But you need to cleanse yourself first. Well, there's different levels of the Secret Eye. You can only get a secret eye if you can be trusted. So. so congratulations. That was a nice surprise. I didn't see that coming. It's coming in. Could be coming in. DNA can be changed and altered. Wine, have a nice drink and relax. Cry it out. Beans, refried beans. You like bean burritos? I used to live off of them when I was really skinny. And like the soy um, protein mix, I used to drink that with a bean burrito like every day. Yes, every day, not like every day, every day. Oranges, vitamin C. I need lots of vitamin C too. It's been very cloudy. Um, eggs, lots of eggs. Lots and lots and lots of eggs. You probably need at least five eggs a day. Boiled eggs. Cheese. Yes, you need calcium. Grilled cheese. Apple pie has been going around. Everybody needs, I guess the apples are going to be out of this world this year. Um, more cheese. Wisconsin, isn't there lakes up there? Um, has some cheese and crackers and salami and wine and sit and cry your eyes out. Ice cream, guacamole, Chinese food. Okay, and go treat yourself. Have a nice Sunday, hot fudge Sunday. Danishes. Yes, you definitely need fat. You have like no fat on your on you. Um, spinach. You live off a of cow. Roasted chicken and roasted turkey. You're supposed to eat turkey all year, FYI. That's it. Oh, another burrito. Well, you can't be a warrior if you're skin and bones. The wind will not blow you over. fight it, the more, the harder it is.
333, right? And Keisha Cole, I should have let you go. So you can probably listen to that album. Do you have this deck? No. The Dark Healing Chamber. Beloved Initiative. The most challenging task is not to confront an external enemy, but to take courage in both hands and journey within to meet our own dark self and begin the healing task of beginning love, acceptance, and light to it. That is the sacred purpose of any enemy within or without to bring us more deeply into our own being as we seek to find the heal the darkness within. So seeing um, the light in the darkness. So that would be St. Germain. <clears throat> That's the Herman energy. The temple of the Black Oxidine is a ruthlessness, honest place of new love and healing, truly profound and lasting. Deep relief and transformation can occur here. Black Oxidine is protective and revealing. It re will prevent harm from external or internal forces, but it will also reveal that which has been lurking in the shadows of the self, trying to avoid being brought out into the open for fear of commandment. I'm sorry, my dog's barking. Hold on. Okay, 11.50, it was paused. Sorry. <clears throat> it takes more, yeah, more money and more energy to be good. That's why the churches get the donations and stuff like that. Because you're always replacing things, cleaning things. You need all new stones. But like I said, don't worry about that. You need to go on vacation. <sighs> just do quick messages for people. Don't look into it. Just read the surface. Because you're being, you know, regrounded. So, um... The biggest challenge we face is entering the temple of the black oxidine in our own inner willingness, <clears throat> excuse me, to love and accept all parts of us. The infinite who is invited to enter the temple of the black oxidine enters into his or her own shadow. The part of us that is hidden from our own awareness and is usually only experienced in relationships to others, quite often as protection. Lady Isis of the Dark Priestess of the Temple of the Black Oxidine invites you now to confront the parts of your own ego that you have denied previously. Why? Because in doing so, you will gain more freedom, come to know yourself more wholly, and you will find that life experience, opportunities, relationships, and breakthroughs that you have not been able to reach will suddenly become available to you. The dark chamber always leads to the light chamber, but one cannot avoid the intuition, the temple of the black obsidine on the pathway to more light. Isis will assist you in preparing for this journey by encouraging you to not allow yourself to become your own worst enemy. Most of the fear we have before the dark chamber of healing is the fear of its own self-criticism and rejection. Isis declares that the readiness for the dark chamber requires a willingness to experience non-judgment companions and a readiness to accept the self in all expressions. To safely enter the dark chamber and be healed, you must prepare yourself to give yourself love unconditionally. You must be able to recognize judgment that you hold towards yourself, not as truth, but old patterns. This is why the successful in, um, initiation of the dark chamber is a truly advanced stage of soul development. The heart has become willingness to love unconditionally 
An initiative must be able to witness feelings that arise with kindness and acceptance, but not fall into them, overwhelmed, crushed, or deflated by any darkness found within. It is worth the challenge because finding peace from pain, self-criticism, self-doubt, fear, and self-judgment through healing is a temple, is a gift beyond measures. Okay, and this is why I don't read books. Everything's already been written, so I don't need to write a book. I was, I wanted to know what this, this symbol, this outer symbol was, but it wasn't in there. And like I said, that this is the, what she didn't even bring up. This temple, the dark temple, this is hermit. It is finding the light within, re, reinitiating, relighting your flame, your candle, your light, your torch, your lantern, whatever you want to call it, the lighthouse. Okay. And you stay there until that light shines. Till you start seeing the light within. Till you start seeing your beautiful soul shine again. Okay. Well, we're in the swing for vacation. It's called the swing months. So you should be able to find something pretty affordable. Okay. Well, you have to find someone that brings takes pets. Just don't tell them about the cats. You don't have no one to babysit for you. you. Gotta have somebody. I feel like I'm missing a deck to do a reading for you. I don't know. You're gonna have to come back next month. It'll be very important for you. Well, this is what happens when you don't want to further your education. I'm not yelling at you. This is everybody. You expect everything to just be granted to you, given to you, a magic wand. You have all the information, knowledge, power. And that's not how you do that. You put the time and effort in to get the, the knowledge and the work to get, you know, your acquisitions. So you plateaued out with what you have, what you accomplished. Yeah, you totally just need to dump this, whatever happened, and let it go and look into the future. There's the betrayal. Burden. Burden. That's the... Everything that you never let go of, that you learned on, that you hold on, and it just keeps piling up until you let it go. That's the weight of the world. That's Atlantis. You have to drop that. This relationship's been completed. And now you're in regrets and crying over the past. And here's the doorway. You're getting pushed. You already chose the light. We're pushing it through. Death. Transformation of the self. Not the situation. And that is the truth. Yourself. Oh, doing tarot. Ther tarot card readings on you. And there's been a divine block on this. You have new wish fulfillment coming in. Wounded over battle. Everybody's been cut out. And you're in the planning mode. These are lessons. You do have somebody from your past, but not right away, that you can build with. Probably a twin flame soulmate like the rest of us get. Coming in. Yes, they do set they will satisfy you. Somebody's doing terror magic. They're trying to do terror. I was gonna say terror magic, but um, this is my terror magic card, but um Lots of sex and passion and love in the future. But you got to get through all this first. Okay? This self-betrayal. <sighs> oh, so we're not getting in anything because you know what happened. You're at the gate with Michael. You need to be cleansed before you can get to the gate of Gabriel. Well, you're in the hall. That's what the Black Ops Dine Temple is. And until you light up and get cleansed, you're going to go through Sirius, the baptismals with Gabriel. Um, you can't get to the hallway. You're in the hall, the waiting hall. Until you've been cleansed. Until there's a light come out of you. Okay, it could take years. It depends on you. How fast you let this go. Michael, please. <clears throat> the 
you don't need a book. You need to clear your mind. Admit the truth to yourself and act accordingly. Get wine and cry it out. You and your loved ones are safe. The money you want to waste on books, go get wine. And get all the fr fruit that I told you. Now it's a Mexican. You and your loved ones are safe. Guacamole dip. Take your time making this decision. You can make get that stuff very cheap. And make it at um, the place. Well, that's the thing when you go to the beach, they have little efficiencies and they have a, um, you know, a, a stove and stuff. Have confidence. You know, you are getting a shield in us in your... I was going to say stone, but maybe your, um, your knife's still in the stone. I keep wanting to say knife instead of sword, so... Write about your thoughts and feelings. You're guarded and protected. Prayers will help you through this situation. You need to go get a rosary. Romance angels are helping you. Okay, so they're still deciding. I guess there's a couple people. Good fortune, enlightenment. Face your fears. So whatever you conjured up doing all this spell work, you need to face it. Dolphins, yeah, that's the beach. Go dol well, I don't know where the dolphins. Well, if you pay for that, it's not guaranteed that you'll see the dolphins. So. And, uh, yeah, the whales, uh, there was a big, oh, that's in Australia. Big Tsumi, not everything washed up. Memories, so you need to go through all that. Self-resilience. Yeah, you're pr probably some kind of Atlantean princess. Looks like I'm getting from you. I don't know. You're orphaned right now until you figure out who you are. Definitely, you're a, a royal. You're on both sides, mother and father, but you're only Atlantean. You haven't mixed the blood yet. Competition, originality, seven deadly sins. So you're down seven layers. You got to get through there. You're going to be down there a while. <sighs> My heart hurts for you. Friendship. Archangel Raphael. That's who you need to pray to. Closing oracles, please, for Leo. I don't know if you're on the... I do the monthlies. Every sign. I call everybody's name. Some of them don't come through right away, okay? Um, and then the, the messages, the extra messages I do for the month, you have to sign up for them ener energetically. You've got to get through and sign up for them. Or if you want to jump the line, Cash App and PayPal is open for gratitude. You just write down your sign and what date you want it for, masculine, feminine, and I will do it. You get to jump the line. Communicating. How could you possibly get through to me if you're down seven layers of hell? My, my pets are shedding really bad too. Partnership. That could be any partnership. Joy. Finding friendship and joy. Being gentle with yourself. Letting go. There's the water. Waterfall. There's got to be somewhere where you can go. The king. Yeah, you're releasing your masculine energy. Back to the feminine energy. Holy grail. Refilling back up your cup. Do you have restrictions on you right now and blocks on your pathway? Um, the mystery. Yeah, you're in the tunnel. Chamber, tunnel. Well, you're at the, the um, high priestess, but it was in reverse and I flipped it this way because you've been doing magic. Listening to yourself. Finding your wisdom. You can't move forward until your light initiates back in there and you release all this stuff. Then you got to go face each level all the way up to the back up to earth, to grounding level, we call it. That is when you'll be regrounded. All right, talk to you later. Bye.